morning so in this video we are going to see a recruitment news from madras fertilizers limited that is mfl so there is a recruitment happening for the post of apprentice and they are recruiting two categories of apprentice graduate and technician or diploma apprentice okay so nowadays there is a lot of apprenticeship uh, recruitments happening so if you are interested please do first enroll to the mhrb nats portal and do regularly check the sites okay so uh, we are going to see all details regarding this recruitment which is from mfl Okay, so the recruitment is happening from Madras Fertilizers Limited. The location of job is Chennai. Okay, so they are actually recruiting for two categories of apprentice, graduate and technician. Okay, so first we are going to see the branch details of the graduate apprentice and also then we will be seeing the technician apprentice branch wise details. Okay, so the graduate apprentice they are recruiting for first one is chemical and it is including chemical, petrochemical, petroleum, petrotechnology, engineering. So, in any of these branches, if you have engineering degree, then you can apply. 13 vacancies is there. The next category is mechanical engineering or automobile. Both they are actually combinedly recruiting. 3 vacancies is there. Then electrical and electronics engineering or electrical engineering, one vacancy. Then instrumentation. In that, they have actually put ICE, EIE or instrumentation engineering. Okay, one vacancy. Then civil engineering with one vacancy. IT, CS and also along with IT and CS they have put the electronics and communication branch also. Okay, So these type of uh, combination they have actually made in the branches. And for this branch that is IT, CS and uh, EC there is two vacancies. Totally there is 21 vacancies for graduate apprentice and the duration of this apprenticeship just like for any other apprenticeship of government of India organizations here is uh, here it is also for one year. The stipend that you are going to get is 20,000 rupees. If you compare with the other uh, government organizations stipend, this is very much higher. Okay, Generally, they will be giving 8,000 or 9,000 for graduate apprentice. Here it is 20,000 rupees per month. So if you are a fresher, if you have not done anything till now, this is a golden opening for you to start your career. Okay, So that is for the graduate apprentice. Next is for uh, technician or diploma apprentice. Okay. So, branches they are recruiting are branch-based vacancies we are going to see. Okay, first one chemical with 15 vacancy, then mechanical automobile with 4 vacancy, electrical and electronics or electrical with 2 vacancy, instrumentation uh, with 2 vacancy, civil engineering with 1 vacancy. Okay, so in any of these branches if you have diploma then you can apply. Total 24 vacancies is there and 17,000 rupees is the monthly stipend. Again, the duration of uh, apprenticeship training is for one year. Okay. So, these all things they have given uh, in detail. Now, the qualification requirement is for graduate apprentice, you should be having an engineering degree uh, in the respective disciplines. And uh, for diploma apprentice, you should be having a diploma. That is diploma in engineering for the respective branches. The age limit they have not mentioned uh, in numbers, but they have given it is as per the apprenticeship rules. Okay. So, minimum 14 year is the age limit for apprenticeship. So, above that if you have age limit then you can apply. Okay. Next, uh, the duration of training as I have mentioned in the beginning it is for one year only. And also the location of training will be in Chennai. Chennai MFL is the location of training. Okay. Selection process is uh, just like any other organization. Here also the selection is based on the merit only. There is no examination. There is no interview. Only document verification is there and that too will be happening in the Chennai location. Okay. So, all these things they have mentioned clearly in this notification. Okay. The selection process is based on merit only. So, you just have to apply and wait for uh, getting shortlisted or recruited. Okay. Now, talking about, talking about the application procedure. So, the application is actually uh, they are receiving through the MHRD NATS portal. First, you have to enroll to the MHRD NATS portal. If you have not enrolled till now, first you have to enroll yourself. Then after enrolling, you will get your specific enrollment number. After that, uh, you have to click on the request for establishment menu. From that, you have to select this particular establishment or this organization, which is MFL and then apply online. Okay, so that is the procedure you have to follow. Okay, now talking about the last date for applying is uh, first of March is the last date for applying, uh, but the last date for enrolling into the NHRD, uh, MHRD NATS portal is 24th of February. Okay, 
So first you have to enroll yourself in the last date is 24th of February. So please do enroll yourself before that and please do apply for it as soon as possible. Okay. So that's all about the recruitment news from MFL. This is a golden opening. The stipend is actually very attractive. So if you are not doing anything, you can always try for this. Because you just have to apply. You don't have to uh, give the examination or interview or anything. So directly you will get recruited if you have a good percentage uh, in your engineering degree or in, in your diploma. Okay. So that's all uh, about the recruitment news from uh, MFL. If you found the video useful, please do give it a thumbs up. Also share it with your friends. And if you have more videos, please do subscribe to the channel. Thanks for watching and keep on watching.